Hey, everybody. How you doing? Amy Blue Sky here. Today we have another episode of the Worlds of Dubtown Tours. We are taking a tour of J-Suit. J-Suit? It's built in uh, Season 5 of the BWO Patreon server. He's got a number of really fantastic builds. Beautiful stuff. Uh, we really enjoyed doing it, and I hope you do, too. I hope you um, are able to get some inspiration from it. He's got some good ideas about how to get big builds done, how to get a number of builds done on uh, on a server during a, one season. And I, I really appreciated hearing his perspective because I don't know about you, but um, I really don't do very much planning. <laughs> it's like, I get on the server and then I kind of figure out what I'm going to do. And, and it's a little frustrating because it seems like I never get anything finished. So let's take it, let's get right to it and look at his fantastic builds. Hopefully you'll be getting some inspiration too. You want to tour the museum and then the... Um, the other one is it the Phoenicians? Phoenicians? Oh, the the, Phoenicians. the, the Persian what call, Roman. What are you calling it? Called like I, I was going for like Persian, but Persian. Mm -hmm. we'll call it Persian Roman. Okay. Do right, you want to do the museum first? Sure, let's do that. So, tell me about your inspiration. My inspiration is just trying to be uh, real life. You know, mm -hmm. I, that's where I get my inspiration from. You know, I, I'll drive around car in life and just you know see these certain structures and you know, oh, I, I wonder what that would look like in Minecraft. And, how about if I just build it? <laughs> and see what it looks Probably like. Probably watching. Right? Or if I'll be watching a movie, I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, that would look pretty cool. What would that look like? You know, all blocky in Minecraft, and then next thing yeah, I know, I got you know a, a dinosaur museum. Yeah, this is that's, actually that's, really cool. <laughs> got the big Jurassic Park-like doors here. Yeah, it's fantastic. I didn't even know it was here until um, I've been gone for a while, and I came on, and a couple of people said, "Oh, you got to come here and come look at this." So we, Uper and um, Scanarby, I think, <laughs> we walked around. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I actually planned this before the season began. Oh, really? Yeah, I. Uh, yeah. I, I, I took time off between the, you know, the season began, or for last season. Mm -hmm. I took like like six months off just to recharge the juices, you know, play some other games, yeah, catch up on life, and then I, you know, I don't know what I was doing. I was just like, I want to do Jurassic Park, and I had this whole huge plan to do like the entire island of of Jurassic Park. Right, that would be um, quite a big build. <laughs> like, <that's, laughs> Ambitious. I don't know uh -huh. if I want to do that. I wanted to do it in your spawn. Mm -hmm. I'm looking around your spawn, like, where am I going to put an entire theme park? <laughs> you know, that makes sense. And there's nowhere to do it. So I decided to scale back and just do what I initially planned, uh, planned out, and that was the visitor center. And then you but also we'll, have. We'll just, Good. Which we should probably take a look at too is the um, the dig. That's oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I did the dig before this as kind mm -hmm. of like a teaser. That's what I thought. Yeah. And I'm like, hey, something big is coming. So that's where I uh, I, I made the dig. Do you want to go look at that first? Yeah, sure. Let's go look at that. That's that was like you there. know the uh, yeah, it's this way. It's like near my house. This house is very nice too. Thank you. The custom trees, I know that. <laughs> yeah, I feel like the custom trees really, you know, bring it to life. And this little, the, the path going up and the waterfall is really nice too. Yeah, I, I, I wanted it. I was looking all around the spawn, and I'm like, this this hill looks really awesome to put a a, a tree on. Not sure a, a house. Mm -hmm. yep. and it's it's actually like kind it. of like a, a rebuild of, of one of the houses I built on season three. 
Oh, really? We, uh, in uh, we, in we, the Wolves, Wolves, what's it called? Wolves Bane Keep? Wolves Bane, yeah. Yeah, Wolves Bane Keep. Kingdom of so, Wolves Bane. We'll take a look at that one of these days. <laughs> yeah, one. <laughs> we'll get that figured out. And we don't have as many technical difficulties. Yeah. Here we go. Here's the, the dig site, which is loosely which built is around. It's kind of funny because we were joking there about when you made this dig site and then the dinosaur museum. It was like right before Minecraft announced that they were going to do that archaeology thing in the new version. Yeah, no. Like they were, I was like, they, were yeah. like, they were spying on you. <laughs> they were. They should. They should hire me. To come up with ideas. I'm uh, I'm crammed full of ideas, uh, but I wanted to, to to have like a I thought because there's a desert right out here next to Spawn. Mm hmm. Yeah, that'd be a cool place for a dig site. Like, you know, scientists make this stunning discovery in the desert. With all these dinosaur huge bones. Huge fossil. Yep. So when you started using the armor stands a couple seasons ago, right? Yeah, uh, season three. Season three. Yeah. And it's uh, oh, it's one of the best tools to bring your build to life. Is uh, once you have like people roaming around. Mm -hmm. It's not stagnant anymore. You know, you got this guy's looking yeah. at a map here, trying to figure out where to dig next. Right. You got this guy <laughs> over here, you know, taking rubble away, looking all goofy like he's a squid. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I love the squid because they got their eyes going all kinds of different directions. Yeah. <laughs> and you got this guy, you know, overseeing the crane. big bone coming out of the uh, the ground. It's just the, the best tool. Uh, if, if you don't know how to use that armor stand mod, do it now. Yeah, I need to learn how to it'll, do it. It'll take, you know, a bunch of barrels and bones lying around and turn it into something really great. And I like how you can introduce humor into it. Oh, oh God, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. This is kind of ba uh, loosely based on the uh, the Jurassic Park uh, dig site at the beginning of that movie. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, I really like it. Yeah, when I first saw this, I saw this truck and I thought it was Uper's build at first. <laughs> yeah, I know. I was actually going over to his build to see how he how he did his. Uh, oh yeah, I have a, his a like crane RV operator. thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I I got this off of uh, like a, a picture off of Google. I'm like trying to Google like simple cranes instead of mm -hmm. like construction cranes. And that one was kind of black and red, and I'm like, "Oh, what a good way of using the uh, the new blocks mm -hmm. from the from the latest update." Yeah. So I got the black stone, and I got the uh, crimson. I call crimson stem. I think. Uh, yeah. I forget. It's, wood. The, it's it's the red. It's the crimson wood. The red yeah. nether wood. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. It's good. Yeah. I got these, these guys just hanging out and digging. <laughs> and that was like the, uh, you know, the introduction to prelude to the, yeah. the museum. Which I put over here, which we started on. Can you turn down your wife? Okay, I turned on my wife. <laughs> <laughs> I've tried for 10 years. Just, yeah, just so she knows she's going to be recorded in the background. <laughs> okay. I, I could ask her to uh, um, I don't know go if, to a different room. If I can parse it out or not, I can try later. I don't want to worry about it now. <laughs> I, I can ask her because she she said, "Do you want me to go to a different room?" And I said, I said nah, it "Shouldn't be that loud." Yes, she is. <laughs> These trees oh, are good too. She can hear me. She hears me talking. <laughs> she, her ears are burning. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, yes. she can hear me talking halfway across the state about her. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wife sense is good. Wife sense is strong there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we are, Paleo Kingdom. 
Come on in. So the first thing I did when I was planning out this museum, what do you think mm -hmm. the first thing I did? Uh, first thing I did was put in the dinosaurs. First thing I did was <laughs> dinosaurs. Uh, I did everything in them. <laughs> exactly. I did everything in creative first, and I said, "I'm going to build this this big thing, and then I'm going to try to put dinosaurs in it that won't fit, and then I'll have to tear everything down and start all over again." So let me get the dinosaurs right, get the measurements mm -hmm. there first, and then you know, like mold the the building around it. The building They're really good. Us. The dinosaur skeleton. No, I'm, really I'm good. very proud of it. I. I, I went online to see how other people did dinosaurs, and of course, you know, people go really, really big right. to get something more realistic. And I didn't want to do that because, you know, that's that's a lot of work. That's a lot of time. Mm -hmm. And this is so really good, though. I, uh, I mean, it represents the bones. <laughs> yeah. And a lot of people use, like, the bone blocks, but, you know, I go with quartz because you can go with stairs and... I just started noticing that that, um, that you and um, and Icy and Napster are using these gradations of white uh, more than I noticed before. I really like it. Oh, that's it's, I, the quartz is I one of the most beautiful blocks that. in the game. But mixing it with other blocks with other whites, it's nice. So it's not just yes. one white color. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I like it. But it's, but it's funny, I, I talk about, you know, getting the measurements right on, on the on these dinosaurs. Mm -hmm. I still kind of got it wrong because I didn't come in, you know, account for the stairs that were going to go here. Yeah. So if you notice on both dinosaurs, their tails are wrapping around. Yeah, but that makes it more cool. It does, yeah. <laughs> it, 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 it gives it character. But that's, that's, that's where that came from. Otherwise, they probably would have... And a little straight. bit more straight. Yeah. <laughs> I like it curved. Then after even after yeah. I, I I got the uh like the Tyrannosaurus all all modeled out, I, I got into my head, I think I want his foot to be up on a like a a, like a, a rock or a boulder. Mm-hmm. So I so went back and creative it. and, and <laughs> instead of, you know, redoing the whole dinosaur all over again, I just figured out how high to make a leg, nice, and I kind of sculpted it around that, and then I came here and I uh, put it back on there. I, I like how you a, have the. A... Oh, you change it here. Yeah, yeah. After you had already put it up, yeah. Mm -hmm. And that just gives it a little, just a little bit more life, some more life, some more character. Mm -hmm. I think so. It was like it's trying to get a, a you know. A little bit taller against this, uh, this one called again, an Almosaurus. And that's cool that you have the real names there. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, 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 I did some research. <laughs> uh -huh. And you can read a book about them. See, it's just like a museum. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I went on Wikipedia. I was like, okay, this is what this kind of dinosaur is, this is what that kind of dinosaur is. Yeah. It's these kind of details I really like. And, um, and uh, these bars holding it up, that's really good too. Yeah. People I, might forget, uh, well, I, forget that I, little detail, it's important. <laughs> I, I, I live near Washington, D.C. So I'm I'm near all the museums. Mm -hmm. And so I, I can go in and see, I, I, I've seen these kind see of, done. you know, yeah, yeah. We saw uh, a T-Rex skeleton in Vancouver, actually, BC. <laughs> that. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Uh, Looks good. It's funny, this floor, it then I, threw people. I, did you come yeah, up with yeah, this? People, I know, it, I it's did, like was, it's a mirror. I was trying mirror. to make it more like a... I was trying to do like a almost like a marble kind of effect, but uh -huh. you know how like marble is kind of like shiny and all. So I was I was mm -hmm. just I was just did like a thing like a layer of glass over terracotta. 
my, it gives my it whole... like this. It gives it like this mirror effect. It's kind of um, you lose perspective. It's like whoa. <laughs> Yeah, because I, I have to like, you know, <laughs> even with the armor stain, I have to put like something underneath it to make it look like it's it's almost like a reflection. Uh-huh. It's good. My my whole, uh, my whole, I, I try to, I don't play with any kind of mods or anything like that, any kind of enhancements. So I, I try to do those in vanilla as best I can. So mm -hmm. well, this floor is... is Kind of like a representation of that. That's good. I saw somebody else has used it actually too in another build of theirs. They? This idea. Uh, have to it's, catching it's catching on. It's catching on. And then I had all this extra space. I'm like, what, what, what do I do with this space? Well, more mm -hmm. dinosaurs. <laughs> I got the the flying one, the pteranodon. And there's more back here, right? Oh, yeah. 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 The uh, the only one that isn't originally mine is the uh, the Triceratops head mm. on the other side of the uh, museum. Oh yeah, that one I I, I, that. I did get get from. Uh, oh, this one over here. Who, yeah, this one. Oh yeah. I I, I saw a skeleton like this online. Yep. And I and I saw in some museums, you know, sometimes they just have parts, of parts the, of them, right, that they're able them. to recover. Yeah. So I was like, oh, well, what if they just have the head? I only have so much space in the museum. Let's just let's have a head hanging here. <laughs> I got a little restaurant back here. Why did you decide to use hay bales for the roof? Because if you look at the uh, the, the real uh, building from the movie, it's mm -hmm. got like this. Um, it's almost like straw for the, for the hmm. roof. Um, so I was going through the I've block palette. So it's I'm like, like so it's supposed to look like a village building or something. So what they were going? Yeah, for? something like that. Something yeah. you know from the era, I An guess. African village or something. Yeah, yeah, that's that's it. I use hay bales, which I actually kind of like the hay bale going with the uh, sandstone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is, is, good. A, is, a, is a good is a good match. I I didn't have the patience to grow them all. Yeah, I know. I remember when you were asking for help. <laughs> so I, I I got help from uh, from Marcel, and and I named this dinosaur after him. Ah, that's good. <laughs> this is the uh, MC MC Elodac. Where's that one? Uh, the, the flying one. Oh yeah. Let's see here. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, that's for him. MC L. Ah, and, <laughs> and then even in the a name for one of our <laughs> museum's generous donors. That's great. <laughs> he, he, he came in here I said hey you know take a dinosaur you want to na have named after you and that's the one he picked so there you go and then you've got offices back here right I do yeah I was actually just starting to uh, put some armor stands in the offices too oh to yeah make it look like uh, oh yeah here's a guy sitting here <laughs> I'll get on the other one there we go. Let me go see you. There he is. This guy doing his paperwork. Now this guy's trying to enter and he's like, no, he's doing busy work. Stop. <laughs> Do you have an appointment? Dinosaur work. <laughs> yeah. Let me see your papers, sir. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Here, get get your interview. <laughs> Come work at the museum. And the park. The pith, my, get a pith helmet. My dinosaurs. <laughs> get eat my dinosaurs. You have to sign them on the dotted line where it says that the the park is not uh not accountable for any lost <laughs> limbs or lives. 
then over here. That when I was a kid, too. when when I was a kid. I I don't know if it was on a field trip or if I saw like a documentary or something. But I know when I was younger, I s remember seeing a museum where you could go up and see the the scientists actually working mm. on the fossils. Mm -hmm. You know, chipping away. Obviously, you know, it's it's not like this in real life. They they don't using giant pickaxes. They're using small brushes <laughs> and right. You know, you know, stuff that they would use to like clean your teeth. <laughs> Yeah. That's, yeah. that's that's kind of where, where this comes from. This is this is a cool idea. I really like this. You you can you can see this the scientists you know, working <laughs> their magic on getting the, 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 the fossils ready for display. Is there something written down here? Oh yeah, a little bit written down here. Oh, yeah. It's the same thing, it's just like room oh, yeah. number two. Yep. Paleontologists at work. <laughs> oh, sorry. Close that right in your face. That's right. I got it. <laughs> and uh, one day, if the ambition really strikes me, I'm going to put like a secret door in here that leads down to like the genetics uh, lab. I thought it was secret kind of genetics lab. Lab. Yeah. Have a genetics lab <laughs> where they're growing the mm -hmm. dinosaurs. <laughs> or maybe, or maybe like where the lab has been overtaken by uh, uh -huh. dinosaurs that have escaped. It's gonna escape. They're about to escape and tear apart the server. That's <laughs> <laughs> my museum. It's good. I like how there's nothing you've gone. Every detail, everything is finished. It's cool. Yeah, this is uh, it's 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 probably one of my greatest builds I've ever done, to be honest. You think? I'm I'm very 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 proud of it. Even the uh, the banner up top. Mm hmm. It's good. <laughs> there are no expense. So you built the um in season four. You built some stuff in Spawn Town. Season three, you did the Wolf's Bane Keep. And what about before that? When did you start on the server? Well, that, was, that was day one. Day one. Okay, there we go. So I was, was on season one. Yeah. Season uh, one, I, I I did like a uh, I did like my house and oh the baseball stadium. Do you remember the baseball stadium? Oh yeah, I do mean. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. That was me. I'm remembering now. And you did some nice builds around Spawn Town in it too, I remember in season one. Yeah, I did that. Yeah, I had spawns. like a wind farm. Mm -hmm. Uh the the smeltery where you could see where the uh iron and gold was being processed. Mm-hmm. That was what I did in season one. I keep wanting to okay. download those worlds onto my computer, but it's such a huge file. Yeah, it is. Um, and for a while, I had a, I had season one on a server for a while, but I took it off and we started a new world. <laughs> Somebody did something to file around here. Yeah, I was just noticing the funny things around here. Come see the navigation. Did you see these? Me. Did you? <laughs> People like to um, <laughs> chop their heads off. I don't know. I don't have anything against the wandering trader myself. <laughs> Did you see, see this what they've got here? And I want them to go. What is this? Mysterious monolith. They, did you remember in the just news? To do that? Yeah. Do you remember in the news when uh, them, yeah. that monolith that statue in, like, the... in Utah, mm -hmm. not in the middle of nowhere? Yeah. <laughs> was it, oh, was yeah. this you? <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's been here for a while, that's to say. Yeah. And I just noticed this today, actually. <laughs> <laughs> well, who did this one? I don't know. <laughs> well, I know this one's been around too. I just noticed it. It's funny. I, I keep I wanting to call this. Bizarre. It is. I think people. We had this bazaar going, right? 
people building yeah. it and then it just it just goes nicely from this bazaar to your build over there flows really well uh, my build was initially supposed to be part of the bazaar mm -hmm. that's but it that's, just kept getting that's... bigger and bigger <laughs> yeah it got pretty big I keep wanting to call my, it my, Phoenician. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, my initial plan was to do like a multi-tiered bazaar, mm -hmm. and each tier was going to have like a like a a couple of different shops. I don't know if I was going to sell anything, but it's just you know I just wanted to do something along those lines. But this is so I this made, is like I mean, this is like next level, right? <laughs> for you. I mean, for all of us, for you, <laughs> so I think it is. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, fantastic. Yeah. It really is. I, 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 I did kind it's of do awesome. myself here a bit. <laughs> so I built this platform, and then I built the next platform, and then I built the really big platform over here that goes over the water. And I show it to my wife, and she goes, oh, that's great. Are you going to put a temple up there? Uh-huh. <laughs> I, I, I go, yeah, yeah, that was my plan all along. <laughs> of course. And that's why I recommend this. Is this there. a temple you got going here? Yeah. So I'm like, maybe I should do a temple. <laughs> and I love the colors here. The orange, the blue, it really fits into the environment. And this with the sandstone. I'm I'm totally in love with the blue warp stem. I I want it in all my builds from now on. I really do. <laughs> and then I brought in the uh, the red sandstone because yeah. how often do people really we just don't use it often sandstone? enough? Yeah, no, no. Sure. Well, it's 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 not like it's, it's a hard common to get. thing to yeah yeah. I started to to use that, and I wanted to use it kind of, you know, sparingly. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to put it everywhere. I wanted to put it on like kind of like the most important things. Okay. Like so you'll accents. see it on, yeah, like accents and like statues, almost like it, like like if we go into like the the, the story of the, you know the background of this area. If we're doing some some world world building, like this mm -hmm. is like their, their sacred stone. Okay. Like they only use it for, like for the most sacred of things. Special like things. Your, your statues. Yeah. Like, this is a really like, good statue. This is a. It's, it's it's actually a you know another original. I, I I went online to to try to get inspiration from statues and just wasn't really imp impressed with. What makes it good though is how you use the different blocks. I mean, because you, you know you say Minecraft, well it's just blocks and. They're all kind yeah. of these statues are all kind of the same, but this is because you have like the chest plate and different blocks for the arms, and it's great. We can use walls now. I love walls. <laughs> I wish we had walls and everything. <laughs> I know. Yeah. That make that be a mod in season uh, six. Walls for everything. Mod. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> My wife is giggling in the background because she can only hear me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, then we come up here to the, you know this is like the like second this. tier i like how these bases you got it going around here too with the fire it's cool yeah i, 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 like I don't want back. things to be too modern i don't do much modern in any of my builds really you know the, the closest i'll get is you know modern rustic mm -hmm. And the details are really good with the sandstone and the blue. Yep, and then you come have... up here. Oh, it's raining. Is it raining? Can you tell in this environment? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, I think when I came here before, you just didn't have the Phoenix statues. I mean, uh, those those are Phoenixes, right? Uh, Griffins. Griffins. Yeah, sorry. They're Griffins. Yeah. <laughs> Griffins. They're not. They're not a, a holy mine. I, I did get them from online. I, f I forget who who originally did them. They they definitely weren't red sandstone. 
Mm -hmm. But I did have to, to tweak it because I wasn't satisfied entirely with what they were doing. Yeah. Looks great. I, I, I did those before I did the temple. But, you know, I might have did, done these before I even had the idea for the temple because I was going to just have like a bunch of statues up here with, with shops. Ah, then, okay. you know, ha having them in front of the temple just make very, the temple feel yeah. all more imposing more and, and maybe mm -hmm. even like a, a more religious. You got some beacons up there for lighting, I see. That's very good. Oh, beacons and lodestones. <laughs> Those, that's the most expensive chandelier you'll ever see in your entire life. <laughs> you see, each chandelier you'd... takes one with their star and two uh, netherite ingots. Uh, I think B-dubs and Corellos would approve. Uh, they would, yes. Because <laughs> I was in creative and I'm like, I, I, I need... I want some light it's, sources in here. It makes so nice together. Yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. And I was in creative. I'm like, nothing is just doing it. And then I go to these, you know, the blocks that you wouldn't normally use. I'm like, ah, oh, it's perfect. <laughs> it really is perfect. But they're so expensive. My gosh. Yeah. They're, they're worth it. Is that one thing that you try to do? Like with these things, just use blocks that you don't normally Maybe a little yeah. bit out of your comfort zone. Well, of course, yeah. <laughs> I remember when you were working on this floor, you're like, mm, not sure about it. <laughs> I'm still great. not sure about it. I think it looks great. Far away, I think it looks better. It's nice because it makes the, the whole build not too samey samey, right? You don't want it to. Yeah. Happen. Yeah. And I even did a little bit out here too. Mm -hmm, I saw that. Like a smaller it. version in front. Because I felt this was like a, you know, just dead space. And you can fly out here. Just don't burn your... I think, I, I think you said it could be a, a really good uh, <laughs> light for course. Uh -huh. I don't think this is finished down here when I... This wasn't here when I was here. Nice. Oh, yeah, it goes... Whoa, it goes all the way down. Yeah. Up, cool. watch out, watch out. The railing. <laughs> and there's another statue over here. I think I think the one up, up here, the only one I, I have that really doesn't have anything in his hands. Oh, just a regular yeah. old statue. Mm -hmm. And you know why the floor you know why the floors work well up there? It's because of the environment that you put the build in. So you, you have the blocks that the builders like to use, but then it's in this natural environment where there's this purple kind of pink mixed with the yellow and orange. I think that's why it works well. Thank you. <laughs> Just thought it looked pretty. <laughs> yeah. Are you gonna are you gonna sleep in do you have a bed? I don't have a bed. Uh, I have a bed. But I have to like Show it a second. <laughs> Here, I have an extra. <laughs> <laughs> Super mod powers activate. There you go. Okay. All right. And then I got a, a tunnel that goes underneath the whole complex. I just bored I on through like the a... mountain. A new addition that I had. I was going to go in here. And I thought, I think I'm going to wait and... <laughs> I would be surprised. I have two statues out here, too. Now they've got some lanterns that they're holding. Yeah, I like that. They're holding lanterns. I could have made this straight or even, you know, even go out towards the, the water, but I wanted to go the, the, the opposite way of what you thought it would go. Mm -hmm. just, to give it, just to give it a little more character. That's nice. It leads out to this statue here. Another statue. And this is water one of our around. More ornate statues. Mm -hmm. He's got some bells going on. He got a fire. Like a messenger. Yeah, yeah. 
And the back here just goes up to the. Uh, yeah. The back of the. I like the these details. And the building straight ahead is the one I just. I don't want to say finished because the top floor isn't finished, but it's the one I just kind of finished a few days ago. And I and I love you. You're coming through this this tunnel right here. Mm hmm. And it opens up, and 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 you see the building in the background behind this behind big massive pillars. pillar. Mm hmm. And it just That's it good. just gives you the layers. Gives depth. Layer effect. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I love the layer. Effect. Just depth. And and this building is where I made shops at. Kind of like, okay. yeah, that's cool. The, the, the that's idea cool is that I, I, sc I scrapped for over, the, you know, there, the initial is, is kind of what I did over here. <laughs> it's kind of cool because people, you, you know, you have to go through the build to get to the shop. So yeah. I like that. I got, I, I was like actually, you know, just star. kind of just had, talking to old, old new miner. About what I was doing over here, and I was I was, I was making shops. I mean, we were just talking about different kind of shops, and then I thought Persian rugs. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that would be like perfect. It, it is. So I got you a little like Persian that. rug shop, and he came Good over morning. and he's had some nice words to say about the the build, and he left his head, so I, I made his head part of the build. <laughs> he's he's buying a, yeah. a rug that'll. Uh, I think you need to collect more people's tie, heads. Tie the whole room together like it yeah if i get everybody's heads i can i can put them in the building mm -hmm. get them to contribute yeah get us to contribute <laughs> yeah. everybody you know give me a head kill yourselves give me a head i got a little tonic shop here this guy uh, yeah it's cool i like this um almost like a stars. snake oil salesman yeah this guy's over here is the uh the leather work like guy like these indoor outdoor bazaars, you, you, you did it yeah. really well. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was Grizzly that kind of came up with the idea first of having like almost like a Middle Eastern mm. yeah. setting to the, the uh, shopping the area. Shopping district. Yeah. Honestly, you know, I wouldn't have come up with this, this kind of idea. If he hadn't suggested it, and then you see the I, I have an aqueduct here. Yeah, okay, I get to fly up in the game. Tripping all the way around. <laughs> this was tricky. Oh, oh, we didn't see this. How do you get here? To, uh, this water table. No, the old-fashioned <laughs> way. I don't have a, a path okay. going up there yet. I, I'm, I'm going to, but. This is really cool too. I, like I, I, I got a cubert it up here. So I've got a. I, I didn't plan on this water temple to be so big and elaborate. Yeah, yeah. This but of course, cool. you know that's how all my builds end up being. <laughs> I just kind of wanted a a dome. So well, how about we do a. Uh, yeah. Little uh, you know, the thing coming out the front and the thing coming out the back. The roof thing. That's yeah. good. I mean, lore wise, it seems like the water would be pretty important in this area. Yeah. And I've got I've got more statues over here. He, and he's got, oh, yeah, got a bucket of he's got water coming down like off that. of his, uh, which is really glass. That's cool. It's a nice effect. And I've got this, this, I guess this is kind of like the water source, but there's, you really don't know where it's coming from because it's just mm -hmm. it's this <laughs> fountain that's suspended in midair. Could be a spring. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A sacred spring. <laughs> and and as, you, as you can see, it's, it's red sandstone. So it's, it's, Something that's really important to them. It's mm -hmm. that's what I figured. It's, it's the red <laughs> sandstone. That leads out to the aqueduct, which was a really tricky thing to do. Yeah, not because not because I, at all. I <laughs> yeah I I planned it out in creative 
as being straight. If you look uh -huh. way over in the distance, that's how I initially planned it. Mm -hmm. It being straight like that. Yeah. This yeah, is how it's like a, a typical to look. Roman aqueduct. Yeah. Not much fancy. But then when I was over there, I started <laughs> curving it around. I said, oh, 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 what am I doing to my life? <laughs> <laughs> so so I, I, I just kind of winged it. It looks better this way, I think. Oh, of course, do yeah. Think? Do you like it? Yeah. I love it. Anything that's straight is just not going to look like it's natural. It's natural. As much it goes and through the hill like and, that. Ends and curves are are the way to go. The same thing because I I did a lot of the uh, the, the roads out there from from spawn to mm -hmm. uh, the shopping area. Right. I I could have gone like straight and at right angles and stuff like that, but then I you know, I did, I just decided to twist it and turn it. You know, make it interesting. And in this lighthouse out here. Mm -hmm. It seems like every season I do a lighthouse. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't do a, a lighthouse in season three uh, in, in, in Wolfsbane. Uh, but, but that's because there was already like towers like this already. Yeah, there was. I thought this Nico okay, was a lighthouse. And I think so, Kiwi made a lighthouse down the coast from you. Yeah. Yeah, he did a tower. I don't know if it's like it, I think it was a lighthouse, so maybe that's that was my thinking. And this lighthouse, oh, I actually, I, 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 lo I love windy staircases. Oops. Oh, oh, see ya. <laughs> I love, I love doing stuff like this. <laughs> just, just to, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a masochist, just to kind of maybe peeve people off. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I like to make staircases like this, but then I always like put some kind of supports. <laughs> well, it's kind of it's kind of hard to maintain the beauty of it with um, with supports. This is a really good view. <laughs> I, I did this one in creative too, and my initial build of it was even more detailed. Wow. And, and and I had to go back and I'm like, oh my god, this this is just, it's hurting my eyes. <laughs> so this this is believe it or not, this is the dumbed down version, hmm. simplified version. I say, it is <laughs> <laughs> simplified to my brain. Or sometimes when I'm playing my world here and my my four year old daughter is sitting next to me, she loves coming up to the top of the lighthouse and seeing this this light light, light bulb thing. It's cool. <laughs> There's the light, Daddy. And oh, you got a torch over there. <laughs> it's like, wait, 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 wait. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. I have one over there too. Okay. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. You saw nothing. I saw nothing. <laughs> this is really beautiful. <laughs> And the combination, I mean, the oak and the sandstone and the blue wood together. I mean, it seems so simple, but it really looks yeah, good. Yeah, it's, it's, I, I, I look a lot at a lot of the blocks I use and they've been mm -hmm. around for ages, except for the, the, uh, the warp stem. Mm hmm It's brand new. It's a really nice combination. And I, and I think to myself, am I, am I, am I using too simple of blocks? Then I stand back and look at it like, that's uh, how, how you put them together, right? That makes yeah, it exactly. What are these pressure plates over here? I can see something's going to happen. Just covering up lights. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Okay. The baddies don't have no, a no traps. easy place to spawn. <laughs> no, no traps. I'm, I'm not that smart when it comes to traps and redstone and stuff like that. I'm a builder, not a tinker. I'm not sure what my favorite part is because I really like it all. I really do like this market. I mean, I like it all. So, 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 what's this building going to be over I there? Wonder, 
This one, gonna be... you're probably going to love this. This is going to be artist studio. They're like the sculpture oh, studio the, the, where, wow. where they make all of the statues. So you're going to have like a quarry around? Oh, because you know, they make uh, them out of redstone and sandstone. Maybe. Maybe. I was thinking about like maybe ships bring in mm -hmm. stuff. This is actually kind of loosely based off of a uh, an artist studio in one of the uh, Assassin's Creed games. Oh, really? And I think the last one where that where it was actually like ancient um, Greece. Okay. Yeah. It's cool. I like the big doors. <laughs> They want to have big doors so they'd have you know, they'd have room to bring in the you know big slabs of stone that they can chisel down. Right. So that that'll, that'll be my uh, my project for the next week or so. And ships. I, I would like to do some ships. I don't know because I I, I I kind of do plan on doing because I have a, a little port area in front of the, the temple area. Mm -hmm. but I would like to have something there. else over here, over here next to where the artist studio is going to be. Mm -hmm. Some cranes and such, like medieval cranes. Cool. I don't want to put it out past the lighthouse area because it wouldn't make make much sense. The lighthouse is supposed to be the first thing you're supposed to see. I like how you use the stairs and variation to look like it's carved. You can always, you can always tell the J suit build by all the stairs and the fences everywhere. <laughs> there will always be fences and walls on my corners. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of buttons. Anywhere I can put in a little bit of detail is where I'll put that at, just to give it a little bit of interest. I'll, I'll look at a, a something and I'll say, that wall is empty. Let me throw some yeah, fences more, over there. More depth and interest. It, give, it, give it some texture. Yeah, exactly. A lot of texture. I like it. Yeah, this, this has a lot of texture. <laughs> <laughs> I could do it better. I like it. Too. This is it really, your... really becoming one of my favorite areas I've ever built in. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. I don't think I. I don't I've think only I built in a, like a, a mesa one other time, or is it, it's a badlands now? Is it a badlands or a mesa or what? I'm not sure. <laughs> I, th I think us old timers call them, call them mesas. Isn't there variations? Like you know, it changes. Like they have several different biomes yeah. that all kind of look the same and they give yeah. different names. <laughs> I should have my, my armor off. Here, let's do this. There you go. Now I look normal. I look like you. <laughs> but that's because I'm in safety mode. See. You are. I'm unsafe now. Oh, <laughs> Lord. I was just looking upstairs. Yeah, yeah. that's that's going to be like a... Uh, I can't, I can't decide if I want to make that a, uh, like, where somebody lives or if it's going to be storage. Mm -hmm. Offices, maybe, trading. Yeah. The people who run the I bazaar. I have, like, a little balcony up here. Yeah. Like the Collect manager's events. office. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pick them out when they can't pay their rent. I like this, yeah. I like the shape of it. And the flat roof, even, yeah. Hmm? Well, it's not exactly flat, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, it, it, yeah, it was flat before, but then I didn't like it. It wouldn't so be I a JC to build it. if it was flat, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's good. Uh -oh. Even in here, I have a windy staircase. Yeah, I, I remember I noticed that in, um, I think it was season two, the use of oak and sandstone together looks really good. Now season two I actually missed. 
nothing on for season two. Started back up again I'm season stuck. three. Oh. I'm stuck. There we go. Okay. Ha. <laughs> anyway, I got a, I got a secret. What? what? In all of my builds, mm -hmm. I have Easter eggs hidden. Oh, really? Um, what kind of Easter eggs? Uh, Easter egg. You mean like <laughs> treasure or like reference to other games or other places? Just, just a, Surprises? Just, it's, it's an egg. <laughs> an actual egg? It's an Easter egg. <laughs> yeah. It's just an actual egg. I gotta find uh, If you look hard no, enough on no. all my builds, everybody's gonna be looking some of them are. And if you use like mod, super mod powers or elytra, you're cheating. Except for the uh, the portal. Uh, it's, it's not in the. It's not in the chest. Not in the okay. In all my builds, there's an Easter egg. And if you find it, I'll give you a prize. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what the prize is, but I'll, I'll think it's okay. Everybody cool hear that? You. If you can find the Easter egg, first person to get the Easter egg gets the prize. <laughs> Absolutely. One, the one in my, uh, I think that the hardest one is probably in my uh, spooky house. Oh yeah, there's one in there too. So every that, build that has one's one. kind of feet. That was kind of fiendish. You know what? I haven't actually been in that. Yeah, let's go take a look. Mm -mm. Let's go take a look. <laughs> I look at it like every time I'm on here, so I don't know why. I'm in there. <laughs> oh yeah, it's right next to your tree. Yeah. And it's raining too. How how appropriate. Ah. Oh. Nice. I, I, I built this things. house. I built this house, I think, a little bit before Halloween. Mm -hmm. And it was originally, I was, I was looking online. I swear I get a lot of my inspiration is, you know, I, I Google something. I was looking online for, like, witches' houses. Mm -hmm. And the one I found was, like, a, a, almost like a mustardy yellow. Hmm. So this one was almost like a mustard yellow color. Then I started doing it in creative. I'm like, oh, this just looks like. Want to puke? <laughs> <laughs> so I went. I went totally dark. And I think it looks a lot better. It looks more foreboding. Definitely more... looks spooky. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe I've just been too scared to come in here. I think that's. I guess... <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's that scary, but you know. I know. Gotta make it a little spooky in here. Uh, it's been, you know, abandoned and maybe just some, and of course a winding staircase. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is more like my winding staircase, you know, it's like you're not going to I think the, the only thing that's really scary <laughs> is when you come around the corner and you see this, uh, uh the Enderman this head. head right here. <laughs> yeah. Staring at you. Eyes I, was, I, was, I was hoping that would, <laughs> I was hoping that would be ah, somebody no, this is... scare. <laughs> there you go. This is scarier. <laughs> <laughs> is that scary? Okay. That's good. <laughs> it's, like, it's like one of the few zombie villager heads I had. I'm like, I gotta, I gotta put him at the top. Yeah, that's good. It could be pretty soon we're gonna have zombies and. Um, uh, don't leave me up here. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> zombies and dinosaurs yeah, taking over the world. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh wait, we do have zombies already. <laughs> what are we <I> talking about? <laughs> That's my little spooky house. Yeah, I was kind of trying to think of some way to tie it into the tree roots and stuff. And figure something out. Oh, okay. go ahead, do 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 it if you if you can find something, do it. <laughs> tie it all together. It would um. Yeah. Because when I saw the scope, I thought, oh, good things are going on between going in between <laughs> the shopping district and. Downtown. We need more. <laughs> uh, you're gonna have like some some roots coming out. Great. Getting corrupted. 
Yes. <laughs> maybe well, here's the area that we're doing. I should pass this. Yeah. I, I love the mushrooms coming out of your tree. Yeah, I think oh, somewhere I want to put some mushroom houses. Maybe not I actually out of mushroom blocks, on the, on but the, on the ground now. Yeah, <laughs> we should do that. And I have some um, variations of tree houses and stuff I wanted to try. I should do more. I need to do more work in creative to make oh, custom trees, yeah, different sizes. Uh, you know, around. I'm I'm, I'm getting good at their custom trees. I, I feel like I'm you getting are. Good. I know. It's becoming, well, I don't know if it, oh, good might not be the right. It's becoming easier for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Especially these smaller ones. I suppose the more you do it, the easier it gets, the faster it is, and the more you can do yeah. in your builds. Before I, I had like, you know, just like a little regular, you know, welcome to our tree town sign down here. Yep, I saw it. I liked it. Just, I was like, that's not good. And then I had a, a you know a vision in my head of a, a sign hanging from a tree. That's how I got this. And you know, it's it's weighing down the branch. Yeah, it's good. I hope more people will come and build. We'll see. Yeah, come build, people. Come build. <laughs> this is where the cool kids are hanging out. Yep. <laughs> and it's funny. I've got my tree house with a with like like there's like three or four different houses in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean my son checked it out. We're inside. <laughs> it, I have it completely hidden, but the the red house over there is my very first diagonal build. Really? For a house. Yeah. I've never built on diagonals before. In a tree, so make it extra hard <laughs> for yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I, have yeah. all, I have it all covered up. It fits right in there, though, like it should. Yeah, yeah this is really cute. Yours is looking good up here, too. <laughs> it's, it's getting there, making progress anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I like it. You got some good colors it. going on too. I'm liking it more as I go along. I just keep doing it, going at it, working at it. Are you gonna put this diorite everywhere? Diorite. What diorite? On the on the roof up here. Oh yeah, no no no. Um no. <laughs> 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 no, that was a mistake. Don't look at it. No, I did try it, and I said no, I didn't like it. But then I thought, oh, you know, I'm just gonna leave this here because it's different. <laughs> I've decided whether I'm gonna leave this section here or not. A lot of it's gonna get covered up, like you said. So yeah, I didn't want to cover it up too much because you wanted to be able to fly in here. So yeah, you can fly in here. I've tried it out with my elytra, so I can't wait to see the, the the finished product <laughs> with, with its eight million leaves. Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, have I got trees growing over here on the outside of it? Hmm. Yep. Some of the saplings are. Oh yeah, look at that. There. <laughs> Took root. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I like how you got the inside going with the, uh, the, 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 the tree grain. Yeah. The inside of the tree. I thought that was a nice, the tree that was a nice touch. Oh yeah. Tree <laughs> ring. That's why I want to say tree rings. I need to get some, is it concrete or a terra, green terracotta that looks more like moss? I think I'm going to get some of that. Yeah. You're going to wait for the next update. Mm. Oh, yeah, get actual <laughs> moss. But we'll have yeah. a new world by then, so. <laughs> yeah, we will. We'll be off to bigger and better things. 
And so I was looking at the old trees around here. I my place where I live and they're covered in a moss. <laughs> uh. Lots of greenery, but yeah. So much space to fill. We got real estate. Mm -hmm. Everybody come out to tree town, build trees. Mm -hmm. Build some tree houses, build some forests. Maybe some little gnome houses, some what? Mushroom houses. Yeah. Oh, mushroom houses. That's a good idea. Do that next. I thought I got a picture of something that looked like it were kind of mushroom houses. They weren't really mushroom houses, but they kind of looked like it. They just were made out of like red blocks for the roofs and they were like uh, umbrella type roofs. And the houses were kind of wonky shaped. <laughs> Crooked. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> I'll make it pretty. Yeah, well, your builds over there are amazing. It's fantastic. Oh, well, thank you. I hope, I'm sure a lot of people will get inspiration. I don't think I've seen anything quite like that, unless it was done on creative. I hope, I hope people do get inspiration. You know, don't, yeah. I, don't try to build like me. Just, you know, build what you want to build. So if do you spend a lot of time as, Grinding or how? I mean, you know, what's your method? Oh, I don't really grind. I if I like like for materials or. Mm -hmm. I I try to buy what I can. You buy what you can. I, yeah, yeah. Well, like, Everybody you know, has their way, so that's there. why I'm asking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I I, you know, I like to I like to play see the blockies. Mm -hmm. I I spend a lot a lot of time in creative, so. Know, preparing for stuff like this mm -hmm. so you know exactly what you need yeah yeah oh the, the only thing i really grind is maybe like sand yep sand is the hardest thing it... lobster was talking about how they have a bunch of farms that basha made so that he could get materials that way um but still you can't farm sand yeah no it's the one thing <laughs> nope <laughs> You have to go shovel it up. People say I, you know, I, I, I build great builds, but when it comes to doing farms and stuff like that, I just I can't do it. Yeah, it's it's over um, it's it's over my poor little brain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when it comes to doing redstone, you know, you're barking up the wrong tree here. I just don't want to spend hours and hours doing redstone. I mean, if it's a small farm or something to get supplies, I like that idea. I mean, I, I like the idea. That doesn't mean it's all I'm yeah. doing. It. Like, <laughs> yeah. I mean, maybe next season I'll do, I'll try to do like a, uh, a trading hall. Mm, yeah. I think season two was the first time I made it. I My first I, redstone I build. Try. Tried to do redstone for the spooky house. Yeah. Tried to do like I tried to do a heartbeat. Mm. And, and and I I I I could make it go one thump, but I couldn't do the thump thump. Yeah. <laughs> like like I, a, I, that, I, I don't know when I saw Mumbo's. I didn't actually watch all the details, but I was like, that's got to be really hard to do. I watched the <laughs> videos. I don't know what he did. Yeah, I think it's not. It's not like a beginner level redstone thing. <laughs> no, no. I'll just let the house speak for itself and I'll, I'll let the people's own hearts yeah, thump for think, themselves. <laughs> I think the little surprise at the top floor is, is good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Well, thanks for taking the time. Well, okay. when we can figure out how to uh, get seasoned.